Tesla's latest version 9 software update is now out. And of course, right on cue, Tesla's very active base of customers is alive and well on the internet sharing their thoughts. So today we have two Model Xs behind me. A little bit of context here, both of these cars are late 2018 production models. The car on my right has been updated to the latest version 9 software, while the car on my left has not. So today we're going to take a look at both versions, see what's new with version 9, and of course answer some of your questions along the way. So throughout the video, we're going to be showing a side-by-side -side comparison of the old version versus the new version, just so you can see some of the differences. Uh, but for now, we're in the car that has the update, so let's take a look and see what's new. Because version 9 has been out for a little while now, we've seen how people have reacted. So let's start right away with the biggest concern that everybody seems to have, and that is the lack of ability to take an app and move it full screen. As we'll show you right now in the version prior, you had the ability to keep an app on the top, and on the bottom. So if you're one of those drivers that didn't like having to see your maps all the time, you didn't have to. You could keep your backup camera here and your music here. And as you can see now, the maps are always there. And to this point, there's no way to fix that. Just going in order here, let's start with the car settings. Now, those of you that are Tesla owners will immediately recognize that in the older version, uh, there were a few more sub menus. So for example, if you wanted to get to autopilot, you had to go up here to this area uh, into a sub menu and go to autopilot from there. Now, in the newer version, a little bit cleaner and a little bit more like the Model 3 layout, everything is right here for you. And you can adjust all of your settings without as many sub menus. Music is one of the few sections where there's actually not too many changes. Uh, of course, you still have your radio streaming options, phone, tune-in radio, everything like that. Just a bit of a different layout, maybe some things to get used to, but overall the same general feel as before. So next up in the vehicle apps, actually a big change here. Now beforehand, you had all the apps right here, pretty easily accessible, and you could take one, drop it down, and kind of make your split screen version to your liking. Now you have an extra sub menu to go through. You have to go into here, and you can choose your app from there. So all the temperature settings stay the same. Here in Miami, we're gonna keep it on low as long as we can. Uh, but as we go into the fan speed selection, things like that, being that we're in a Model X, you get rear seat climate control. That's something that you do not have in the Model S nor the Model 3. In the version prior, you had two different menu settings, one for front seat climate, one for rear seat climate. Now with version nine, you have everything integrated into one menu. And down here is the rear sections. So you can control all your fan speed for just the rear climate. As to where up here, you can control it for the front climate. And finishing off the rest of the menu, everything from here on out is pretty much the same. You still have uh, your seat heating controls, front defroster, rear defroster, and volume control on this side. Uh, not too many changes going on here between version 8 and version 9. So to end this comparison video, we're going to have a little bit of fun. So we have here the resident Italian in the office, Eduardo. Say hi. Ciao mamma. Hai visto? Sono una stella. Now, because Eduardo's never been inside of a Tesla before, we found it appropriate to end this video uh, by seeing what his reaction is when we show him version 9's hidden feature. And then take this menu here and drag it down and hit Atari. So in version 9, Tesla decided to throw in some old school games, including the original Atari games. Check it out, Eduardo. Give me money. Give me my 25 cents. Start. Mamma mia, this is complicated. No, not at all. Mannaggia! Oh! <laughs>